Kitor Chenama, the 23rd of October 1778 to the 21st of February 1829, was the Rani of Kitor, a former princely state in Karnataka. She led an armed rebellion against the British East India Company in 1824 in defiance of the doctrine of lapse in an attempt to maintain Indian control over the region, but was defeated and died in prison. One of the first female rulers to rebel against British rule, she has become a folk hero in Karnataka and symbol of the independence movement in India. <laughs> Early life Kittor Chenama was born on 23 October 1778, in Kakati, a small village in the present Belagavi district of Karnataka, India. She belonged to the Lingayat community and received training in horse riding, sword fighting and archery from a young age. She married Raja Malasarja of the Desai family at the age of 15. <inaudible> Rebellion against the British Chenema's husband died in 1824, leaving her with a son and a state full of volatility. This was followed by her son's death in 1824. Rani Chenema was left with the state of Kittor and an uphill task to save it from the British. Following the death of her husband and son, Rani Chenema adopted Shivalingapa in the year 1824 and made him the heir to the throne. This irked the East India Company, who ordered Shivalingapa's expulsion, on the pretext of the doctrine of lapse. This doctrine was based on the idea that in case the ruler of an independent state died childless, the right of ruling the state reverted or lapsed to the sovereign. The state of Kittor came under the administration of Darwad Collectorate in charge of St. John Thackeray of which Mr. Chaplin was the commissioner, both of whom did not recognize the new ruler and regent and notified Kittor to accept the British regime. Rani Chenema sent a letter to Mount Stuart Elphinstone, lieutenant governor of the Bombay Presidency pleading her cause, but the request was turned down, and war broke out. The British tried to confiscate the treasure and jewels of Kittor, valued at around 1.5 million rupees. They attacked with a force of 20,797 men and 437 guns, mainly from the 3rd Troop of Madras Native Horse Artillery. In the first round of war, during October 1824, British forces lost heavily and St. John Thackeray, collector and political agent, was killed in the war. Amator Balapa, a lieutenant of Chenama, was mainly responsible for his killing and losses to British forces. Two British officers, Sir Walter Elliot and Mr. Stevenson were also taken as hostages. Rani Chenama released them with an understanding with Chaplin that the war would be terminated but Chaplin continued the war with more forces. During the second assault, subcollector of Sulla Pure, Mr. Monroe, nephew of Thomas Monroe was killed. Rani Chenema fought fiercely with the aid of her lieutenant, Sangoli Rayana, but was ultimately captured and imprisoned at Bailhangal Fort, where she died on 2 February 1829. Chenema was also helped by her lieutenant Guru Sadapa in the war against British. Sangoli Rayana continued the guerrilla war to 1829, in vain, until his capture. He wanted to install the adopted boy Shivalingapa as the ruler of Kittor, but Sangoli Rayana was caught and hanged. Shivalingapa was arrested by the British. Chenema's legacy and first victory are still commemorated in Kittor, during the Kittor Utsava held on 22-24 October annually. <laughs> <laughs> Statue at Parliament House Complex, New Delhi On the 11th of September 2007 a statue of Rani Chenema was unveiled at the Indian Parliament complex by Pratibha Patil, the first woman president of India. On the occasion, Prime Minister Manmohan Singh, Home Minister Shivraj Patil, Lok Sabha Speaker Samanath Chatterjee, BJP leader LK Advani, Karnataka Chief Minister HD Kumaraswamy and others were present, marking the importance of the function. The statue was donated by Kittor Rani Chenama Memorial Committee and sculpted by Vijay Gaur. There are also statues commemorating her at Bangalore and Kittor. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Burial Place. Rani Chenama's samadhi or burial place is in Bailhangal Taluk, but is in neglected state with poor maintenance, and the place is surrounded by a small park maintained by government agencies.
Topic: In popular culture. The heroics of Kitor Rani Chenama are sung by folk in the form of ballads, Lavani and Gigi Pada. Kitor Chenama is a 1962 film in Kannada, directed by B. Ramakrishnaya Pantulu. Coast Guard ship, Kitor Chenama, was commissioned in 1983 and decommissioned in 2011. The Indian Railways train Rani Chenama Express connecting Bangalore and Kolhapur is named after her. Raiganj University Associate Professor Panaki Roy's essay, Alternative History, a Postcolonial Rereading of Nikers the Queen of Kittor, published in the Indian Journal of Multidisciplinary Academic Research, ISSN 2347 9884 1, 2, August 2014, 105 15, offers several instances of critical references to literary representations of the Queen of Kittor. Rani Chanama University in Belagavi is named in her honor. In the season 3 episode 4, Reload, of The Expanse after running low on PDC point defense cannons, ammunition James Holden's crew board the Kitor Chanama to scavenge its remaining munitions and whilst on board the ship they find survivors. Three are rescued and receive treatment on board the Rasanante. The crew of the Rochi repair the KC enough to safely return to a Martian Congressional Republic controlled area, and give it back to its remaining crew along with a message to give to their CO from Christian Avasarala, asking it to be sent along to UNN Admiral Souther. <laughs> <laughs> External links Paintings of Kitor Rani Chenama Karnataka Goddess of Courage, Kitor Rani Chenama, an article by S. Srikanta Sastri.